don't be scared of the change scared to be the new kid What's up, Lily Jane gang? It's your girl, Lily Jane here, back with another Eminem reaction. Now, y'all, yesterday I asked you guys to comment what Eminem song you wanted me to react to, and the one with the most upvotes was Eminem Stay Wide Awake lyric video with the color-coded lyrics, y'all. So let's go ahead and get into this, guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Follow me, follow me. Come with me to the dark side of the forest. I compose art like the ghost of Mozart Even though they all say that they're real I know that most aren't Boy, you think you're clever, don't you? Girl, you think you're so smart Come with me to another side In a world so cold and so dark Yo, this is a whole lot to process because not only am I just trying to read these words, you're trying to find the connection on why the words are highlighted. And in the past, in this last little section here, I was getting the maybe the O was the reason, and then but not return. When will they learn? Okay, the learn, the earn, and the turn. Okay, this also pointing out the rhyme schemes. Okay, okay, y'all, I'm sorry. I'm just really baked like a cake, and it is just a lot to take in. Some will go, but not return. When will they learn? Where do they go? God only knows. Stay wide. Three, five, four, four. I think I smell the scent of a placenta. I enter Central Park. It's dark. It's winter in December. I see my target put my car in park and approach a tender. Young girl by the name of Brenda and I pretend to befriend her. Sit down beside her like a spider. Hi there, girl. You might have heard of me before. See her. You're the kind of girl that I am. Salt and rape and figure why not try to make your pussy wider. Fuck you with an umbrella and open it up. Okay, I think I was I figured out why we're saying to stay wide awake because he says he's entering Central Park here. It's dark, okay? Winter in December, and he's prowling up with this girl, trying to seem like a normal Job, and then he has his own ulterior motive. And he's just saying, like, don't go out in the dark, and you need to stay the why the fuck awake if you are in the dark, because that's where evil likes to play. And y'all made sense. I was curious with like how it was like the blood letters there in the beginning. So Sultan, rape and figure why not try to make your pussy wider. Fuck you with an umbrella that open it up, but a shit's inside ya. I'm the kind of guy that's mild, but I might flip and get a little bit wilder. Can pregnant a lesbian yeah, now let's see a half triplets and milder. Y'all, we got the shock factor with the umbrella going inside ya, going wider. But then he also says, I'm the kind of guy that's mild, but I might flip and get a little bit wilder, okay? Mild, wild, you're just literally rotating that M to a W, so you're literally flipping it. But with the theme this song's already going to, I'm assuming he's probably referring Christopher Wilder. He was a serial killer down here in Florida, the beauty queen killer. He would only go after women that had some type of prestige level to them, like spokesmodels or beauty queens things like that i can't help but wonder if he's referring to him based off the theme of the song i might flip and get a little bit wilder can pregnant a lesbian yeah now let's see a half triplets and milder disintegrate them babies as soon as they're out her with a milder hide and cyanide girl you can try and hide you can try to scream louder no need for no gunpowder that only takes all the fun out of murder and i'd rather go bin bin and now you see just how the fuck i do just what i do when i cut right through your scalp oh shit wait a minute i mean stall my knife seems stall pull another one out as soon as my flow starts i compose art like the ghost of mozart even though they all say that they're real i know that most aren't boy you think you're clever don't you girl you think you're so smart Yo, yo, this is dark. This is dark as hell now that I really think about it. So y'all, when he says, even though they all say they're real, I know that most are. And he's talking about those people that say they're willing to pull the trigger, but don't actually do it when they're making threats against people. And then he says, boy, you think you're clever, don't you? Girl, you think you're so smart. Saying he's one step ahead of them. They get saying that you think you know what the ending's gonna be, but I have a whole nother plot in mind. And y'all, that is sinister. They're real, I know that most aren't. Boy, you think you're clever, don't you? Girl, you think you're so smart. Smart. Come with me to another side in a world so cold and so dark. A world so cold, a world where only some will go. But not return. When will they learn? Where do they go? God only knows. Stay wide away. So dark and so cold, my friends don't know this. A 
other side of me There's a monster inside of me It's quite ugly and it frightens me But they can't see what I can see There's a vacancy in my tummy It's making me play hide and seek Like Jason, I'm so hungry She's naked, see no privacy But I can see she wants me So Okay, y'all, makes me want to ask. So, do you guys know? Let me know down in the comments. Do you think the whole Friday the 13th Jason thing, do you guys think that's based on a true story? Because, y'all, back when that movie was super popular a few years ago when they, like, did the remake and all that good jazz, um, I actually dug into it a little bit. And supposedly, Friday the 13th is a real story. It just happened over in Finland. I just find it entertaining that, you know, Eminem brings this up in here because he's already made a few other serial killer references. Like Jason, I'm so hungry. She's naked, see no privacy, but I can see she wants me. So See, I try to be, but she, why does she taunt me? Pulls the drapes and she goes right to sleep And I creep right through the front seat So blatantly, but silently Cause I know that she sounds sleep Who's waking me so violently And why is he on top of me? He's raping me, she tries to scream Somebody please get him off me He's taping me, he's biting me He's laughing like it's funny She's scraping me, she's fighting me She's scratching like some dumb freak Escaping me, no dice to see I might just be Ted Bundy Or Satan G, what a sight to see I'm dancing in my red panties I'm crazy, but it's alright with me Yo, 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 oh my gosh. So, I think it's very interesting how he says, I just might be Ted Bundy, no dice to see escaping me. And Ted Bundy, if, I'm, if I remember correctly, he was actually brought into custody because one of his victims got away and escaped from him. And that's where his kind of rang of terror ended. But then also too, he said, or Satan G, what a sight to see. I'm dancing in my red panties. And y'all, I can't help but wonder if that is not a reference to the foot fetish killer, y'all. It was Jerry Brutus and Brutus. I, I can never say his last last name right but basically what he did he would go to his vic victims and he was known for cross-dressing and after he would do the deed to his victims he would actually take care of himself if you know what I mean by that in a pair of heels and with their underwear and sometimes he would take the underwear and put it on other victims so I wonder if that's a reference to him there when he says the red panties part y'all I watch so much true crime stuff it is one of my favorite genres it's just one of those things that I'm always curious about why people think this way so this song is right up my alley and I'm so thankful you guys that they suggested this to be because so far this shit is hitting different to me, she's scratching like some dumb freak Escaping me, no dice to see I might just be Ted Bundy Or Satan G, what a sight to see I'm dancing in my red panties I'm crazy, but it's alright with me Man, life can be so empty Stay away from me, cause I'm dancing to quite a different drum Soon beat. as my flow starts I compose art like the ghost of Mozart Even though they all say that they're real I know that most aren't Boy, you think you're clever, don't you? Girl, you think you're so smart Come with me to another side In a world so cold and so dark I'ma try to take pray for light today Right away, why do they try to fight today? I must make them pay twice as much Might as well put the knife away Now I use power tools, how about now? Are you in the shower? Scour you for six hours to outage your power outlets How did you figure out I was down in your basement? Now you must have just heard the sound of my stomach growling from down there Okay, y'all, I really gotta appreciate the effort they put into this video because it does help you see the syllables that Eminem is uh, repeating over and over again and without throughout his rhymes because he really is he has so much wordplay and you don't realize it till you literally see it highlighted in front of your eyes but y'all i am also wondering too how eminem says now i use power tools i'm wondering if they are talking about the toolbox killers and how they had a lot of their victims near this like little beach area where they would take care of business and basically one of the well i think it was the first victim yeah i want to say it was the first victim she was someone that like didn't fight very much because she thought in the back of her mind she might have a chance of living if she didn't you know if she just went along with what was happening and she told one of the guys that were doing you know the deed she told them as long as I get to pray before you do it everything's gonna be okay so I can't help but wonder too how he made the reference a few moments ago about uh, being by the lake and then a chance to pray and then the toolbox I mean then the power tools thing and y'all I just can't help but wonder if that's a reference to them it may not be but just from my own knowledge that's what it reminds me of by the way could you might have the found that by the lake soon as you lay me down to sleep it's your soul I'ma try to take pray for light today right away why do they try to fight today I must make them pay twice as much might as well put the knife 
life away Now I use power tools How about now? Are you in the shower? Scour you for six hours To outage your power outlets How did you figure out I was down in your basement? Now you must have just heard the sound Of my stomach growling from down there Tyler, there's no one fouler Bound you, that's how they found you Face down in the tub, I drown you With piles of downers around you Such nostalgia and power Such prowess, look how you cower Jump out on you now like I was a Jawa From fucking Star Wars Jabba the hut, Betty Baba, Betty Baba It's time to die Okay, I know we had like the little Star Wars and the Star Trek references in the very beginning of this, but y'all, I, I feel like this whole Star Wars shit's taken like a left turn from the main topic. I mean, it keeps you intrigued, definitely keeps you engaged, but I don't know, man. The Jawa from fucking Star Wars, Jabba the Hutt, Betty Baba, Betty Baba, it's time to die, die. Thoughts are not even bother to scream, it don't even matter. Amazing when raising skin with these razor blades, he waves at ya. Not ya every day, Damien, and bathe me in holy water. Nothing like Sun the Sam, so please understand there's no gun in hand. Where's the thrill in the hunt? There's no fun in that. Here I come with axe. Fun to act like lumberjack when I'm hacking them up with that. <laughs> Y'all, okay, so now we got the son of Sam, and the reason, you know, he says here, son of Sam, you know, so please understand there's no gun in hand. Son of Sam would like to use the Rudy Tootie point and shooty to take care of his business, but Eminem's saying, he's like, I'm not like him. I like to get up in their face with axes, and yeah, just the axe here, and it's just like, yo, I just love the contradiction that he made, but also another reference, like, I'm here for There's no fun in that. Here I come with axe. Fun to act like lumberjack when I'm hacking them up with that. What was that? Dial 911. Someone's coming in from the Soon as my flow starts, I can pose out like the can't help but wonder if that one was a Night Stalker reference there because he snuck in to everyone's houses because so many people left their doors unlocked where he said the dial the 911. Can't help but wonder. That dial 911, someone's coming in from the Soon back. Soon as my flow starts, I can pose out like the ghost of Mozart. Even though they all say that they're real, I know that most aren't. Boy, you think you're clever, don't you? Girl, you think you're so smart. Come with me to another side in a world so cold and so dark. Y'all, that was a whole trip. That was a whole trip for real. I love that. That was probably the best suggestion I've had so far on this whole YouTube channel, y'all, because I just, I love the knowledge. I love the bars. I love the, the way it was color-coded. Now, y'all, I could have sat down and broke down every little set on syllable and all that good jazz, but y'all, I like to see other things that are in his lyrics, too, and you guys, at the end of the day, we can all say a lyric means this or a lyric means that, but every person's gonna interpret everything different, and the only way we'll ever know is if an artist literally comes out and says it you know what i mean so i love breaking this down y'all i really appreciate you guys suggesting this to me leave down in the comments some other m, &M stuff i should check out y'all and have a great friday guys